anyone who knows me well knows that I have struggled with insomnia for like my entire life. One of the things that I would do when I was having trouble sleeping is I would just go play the piano for a little while. Um, at my parents' house that was nice because I had just a keyboard I could put on headphones and just no one would know. Um, in college, I would generally like walk all the way to the music building, which was like down the hill from my dorm. So there were a ton of rooms with just pianos everywhere. This is one of the songs that I came up with while I was just like sitting there playing the piano trying to fall asleep. The beginning definitely has this like lullaby feel to it. It's kind of like soothing and calm but there's like the sadness to the music. Well, over the last year or so probably, I have been teaching myself how to use Logic and just like messing around and playing with stuff. And I actually, I posted a song on SoundCloud the other day that's just like an instrumental pop song that I made. It's like one of the first, one of the first songs that I was just like playing around with in Logic. And like the first song that I've gotten anywhere like substantial with it yet. And this is the second one that I've been working on and I'm just like, I'm really excited about it. I think it's really cool. So I wanted to share it with you guys. Hopefully that's cool. It's not done yet. There's still a ways to go, but I think maybe after this video, I'll post like what I've got so far on SoundCloud for people to listen to if they want. Most of the time when I'm working in Logic, I'm just using this MIDI keyboard, which I am in love with. It's portable, but it's like, it's perfect. It has a little B-pad up here. You can control, uh, you, or you can use this to control different like filters and effects and stuff. I have this keyboard, which I would also love to record with, except this port is for the sustain pedal and it's all corroded, which means I can't use it. And I just need to go to a place and have that fixed because I think they can fix it. I just haven't done it yet. Once this piano gets properly tuned, it would be really cool to like record things in this room directly with that piano as well. Maybe I could replace some sounds, I don't know. Okay, so yeah, the first thing I did was record the piano. And I just used this keyboard to do it. And then took a lot of time trying to make it sound like a real piano. So then I added some white noise and it just like, I did that because like the piano is such this like lullaby soothing thing but this whole song I'm kind of relating to the idea of like not being able to fall asleep and insomnia so having this sort of like drone come in that's a little ominous uh, and then having it lead to just that little thing right before we start into the rest of the song. The other things, other things I added at the beginning was just like room tone and a clock ticking. The next section is really just chords right now because I don't really know what to do with it. So at the beginning you've got D, F sharp minor, B minor, and A major. Oh, and then this section is sort of like the first change. This section sort of continues like the lullaby theme into the... That progression that you've heard a million times. Let me solo some of the parts. This is just like the piano, but it's a keyboard. These like piano and synths in the background. And then the bass. This guitar I thought sounded really cool, so really I just, I played it backwards and then bounced it in place, turned it into an audio file, and then reversed it and got this sound. Which I then mimicked in the piano. And then it goes into the solo piano. going into this section it was going to be louder, there was going to be more instruments, it was going to be kind of this like big thing happening. Um, so I added some arpeggio. Along with the rest of the piano obviously. And then I just, I have these synths just to like fill out the middle range. Like I said, this is all a work in progress, so like some of these things may be replaced with other elements at some point. I don't know. It's I've only been working on this song for like 
three weeks now, maybe? So this section is actually what I started with. And then I kind of kept filling it out as I was going. which sounded very bleachers to me, and I was really on board with that. So that was basically all that I had at that point for the song, which was like, yeah, I ended up being able to stretch it into like four minutes or three, and I don't know, like normal song length, but then I had this other idea, and it just suddenly became like a part two to the song, which I became even more excited about. started with this. And then you can't forget the white noise. Gotta add the white noise. Very, very important. <laughs> and from here I just got inspired and I was like, you know what, I gotta fucking, I gotta just go. Ooh. That chord right there looks like that, and it's beautiful. I'm not really happy with the drums yet. I want to do more. I think I need to make them, A, a little quieter because they're very loud. Uh, B, I just, I need to tweak the sounds a little bit. I don't, there's, I'm not happy yet. I need to figure that out. recent idea was that I wanted to have sort of a like solo synth playing for like a bridge and I really wanted to find like a 80s like okay like the synth in Bruno Mars that's what I like that's like very flowy and like sparkly almost but this whole section I added because I knew I needed to have a bridge And then this over here is essentially just repeating because it's already like six and a half minutes and I kind of want to just make it like super long and like eight and a half minutes. I haven't figured out exactly what I want the song to be. Uh, like the end of it feels very kind of dancey but the beginning is sort of more like a ballad. Um, also, I wrote some lyrics for it but um, not like complete lyrics, just like I jotted a couple words down and also I, I don't generally sing, like I'd like to sing, but I'm also very self-conscious about my voice. It's definitely something I'd like to do, but I would like to also feel a little more comfortable first. So maybe some singing lessons. Anyways, I hope you guys liked this video. Like I said, it's something different. So let me know if you didn't, or if you want me to do more music stuff. I definitely would love to do that. I like talking about music and like playing music and I want to play some more stuff for you guys. There will be a link in the description box if you want to go listen to this song on SoundCloud. Like I said, it's still a work in progress. Oh, and my script I just printed out. Very, very exciting. So I'll probably work on the script over the next couple days or so and then give it to my friends so that they can give me critiques. Anyways, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe and I will see you guys in a couple days. Bye!